Letter sent to Master Timmy Dwight, seven years old. December 7, 1785. By Henry Livingston. Master Timmy, brisk and airy, blithe as Oberon the fairy, on thy head thy cousin wishes thousand and ten thousand blisses. Never may thy wicket ball in a well or puddle fall, or thy wild ambitious kite on the elm's thick foliage light. When on bended knee thou settest, and the mark in fancy hittest, may thy marble truly trace where thy wishes marked the place. If at hide and seek you play, all involved in the hay, tittering hear the joyful sound, Timmy never can be found. If you hop, or if you run, or whatever is the fun, victory with her sounding pinion, hover o'er her little minion. But when hunger calls the boys from their helter-skelter joys, bread and cheese in order standing for their most rapacious handling, Timmy, may thy luncheon be more than Ben's as five to three. But if hasty pudding's dish meet thy vast capacious wish, or loblollies, charming jelly, court thy ever-craving belly, mortal foe to meager fast, be thy spoonful first and last. <laughs>